Alrighty, guys. So, yeah. So I died. Very horrifically. So we're not gonna go, uh, near that kid anymore. Because I just found out where the new puller goes. Ha ha! <laughs> yeah. So I had no clue where it was. Like, after, um, I died, I ran around, I died, like, three more times because of that dumb ghost. Oh my god. I died three more times, and then I'm like, where the fuck is this nail puller? So, I then looked it up, and this is where it led me. To this door that is nailed shut. That apparently I was supposed to investigate, even though every other door in this situation is not was nothing more than a decoration. So now, I, so now, it's nailed shut this time. So now I can use the nail puller, so. The door is nailed shut. The nails are hammered in tight. It's not going to open through any normal means so we use the nail puller because anybody was supposed to figure that out although successful in loosening every nail and opening the door the rusted old nail puller broke apart because it's stupid like that Ooh. okay you want to make sure the volumes There's a piece of scrap paper pinned to the wall. You notice dark spots dotting the page and realize they're tear stains. Those who choose to ignore the darkness that dwells in the hearts of man may be stuck forever in a loop. For in this world there are some truths that simply must be known, no matter how disturbing. Yet curiosity can be deadly, and other truths are best left untold. Beware the messages of the dead, for there, but for there be curses among them. For there be curses among them, curses that can crush even the strongest wills, demolishing all semblance of reason. If you wish to protect your sanity, take heed. Do not let your curiosity get the better of you. Do not read the victims' memoirs to their conclusion. So, so yeah, so that document basically described um, what somebody already told me was that these little these little memoir things um don't read all of them you can read since there's five of them you can read four of them just don't read the last one victims memoirs three of five i've been searching every last corner of this school building trying to find a way of escaping with her but it's not happening no matter how much we struggle only further misery awaits us so unbearably thirsty, so hungry that it feels like my stomach is eating itself. And every moment it gets worse. It's like a big black mass in front of me that's slowly closing in. I can't keep ignoring it. I've started talking to the eyeball in my hand to help stay focused and maintain my sanity. Stop looking at me like that. I swear I'll find us a way out of here. I have to make sure I tell your family what you did for me. Well, yeah, yeah, it, your sanity is totally fine. It appears to be a control mechanism for some sort of elaborate pulley system rigged up with a network of fine, virtually transparent threads. There's a lever jutting out from one side. Pull it. Yeah, because I don't think there's anything else for me to do. Aha! Okay. So that is what? The lever seems stuck. It won't budge. Okay, so I was supposed to do that. Okay. Hmm. Just gonna save just so that way I don't have to go through. Uh, yes. Yes. Is that kid still here? Shit, he is! Fuck!
How do I get around you? Fuck you, dude. Alright. I gotta think. If I lead him out here, there gives me a wide range to just get around him. Ah! He's here! Fuck! Okay, cause in this way. This way. Up. No! No, 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 no. Down. No! Too far down! Damn it! Fucking... see you. I see you. Come over here. Come over here. Over here. Up! Over! Bitches! I mean, I feel sorry for you, kid, but... You killed me. I don't like being killed. Being killed is not a fun, happy pastime. Where was the pulley? It was in here, right? Yeah. Oh, goody. Stop. Music. Pull it. Yes. <laughs> Bitch, go away. Ah! You motherfucker. How am I supposed to get around him now? Because if I go up there, he's going to go up there, he's going to go straight at me, and then I'm going to die. Ugh. Oh, you bitch. You bitch. I hate you. Damn it! Alrighty, uh... I think I pulled the pulley. I don't remember. Alright, you little... Alright, you little pixel shit! That's right, come over here. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, you are There we go. Okay, ready? Okay. That really sucks that he could kill me in one hit. I mean, at least the ghost with Naomi took like a couple of hits. I call this bullshit. I mean, Naomi's ghost was like a thousand more, thousand times more terrifying than this kid. Maybe that's why. Alright. Somehow I've got to get there without dying. Ugh. How am I going to do that? Because... The second I like Hmm. I gotta like go around or something. Jump! I don't know. Fuck, what do I do? Hmm. No! Ah! Ah! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! I had it! I had it! I had it! Damn it! <laughs> Fuck you, kid. 
Alrighty. Um. So I kind of had something. So. No! Fuck! No! I wanted to go up one more! Go up one more! God damn it! Freaking kid would just leave me the fuck alone. It wouldn't be such a big deal. But it is a big deal. Because you won't leave me the fuck alone. You won't let me progress. You won't let me do shit. Alrighty. Bitch! Oh! 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 Best! Get out! Fuck, 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 fuck. No! Keep going, keep going! Run! Run, run, run! No! That's not running! That is running into a dead end! Running into a dead end is not a f cool idea! Ah! No, no, no! <laughs> Whew. Okay, I'm out of that room! I don't give a shit! <laughs> Sorry I screamed really loud, but he kind of just like... Freaked me out for a second. <laughs> I don't. All right. Can do this shit. Come on, kid. <gasps> There's two. What the fuck? <gasps> what? Thy shit is this? What thy shit is this? There are two! Shit! Fuck! Fuck! Ah! Uh, uh -huh, uh -huh. No! No! Damn it! Damn it! I had it! I'm pretty sure I had it! Ah! Uh. <sighs> fucking two! Fucking two! There's fucking two of them! Oh, whoops. No, 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 no! Woo, woo, okay, no more, no more, no more, no more, no more clones, no more nothing, nothing, crossing this, bitch, I'm gonna read this. The cursed writings left behind by those who lost all reason must read in the proper order. If one part is skipped, the next will never appear. <sighs> if you insist upon reading such dangerous words too, I pray you have a strong will and a sturdy mind. Okay, dokies. What? What? What is this? What do I do? Oh! 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 Who? Okay. Progression! My- Thy name is... Kishimura! Oh no. What's wrong? You need to stop for a minute? <sighs> I need to calm down. <laughs> uh, okay. No, I just thought this seemed like a good spot for another candle. Thank you. No objections, I assume? Go ahead. I have no objections to candles. Oh, this is a perfect, perfect spot for a candle. You have no idea. Wait a minute. Is this the infirmary hallway? Science lab. Yes, this is the infirmary hallway. We're back here. But there's no squishy parts on the walls or... No, can't go over there. No squishy parts on the walls. So whoever went splat hasn't gone splat yet. Another another body. Judging by the size, these appear to be the remains of a junior or senior high school student ID name tag. Byakudan Senior High School. Roy Roy Suke Katayama. Kitsami. Kitsami. All right. Keep. Mm. No, I didn't just hear. No, I didn't. La la la. 
Yeah, wonder what happened to him. So, if I see a name called Kisami, I should be very worried. I get the feeling he was surprised. I think he died quickly and suddenly. Sudden, suddenly. Oh, look! The last victim's memoirs. Victim's memoirs, four or five. I am writing these memories with sticky hands, but it's not me that's sticky, but something else. I hope you're not mad about this. Maybe you'll think I'm horrible. A person. But I got hungry again. Really hungry. Like I was about to die. So I, I did something I shouldn't have. I promised myself I would stay sane and promised myself I wouldn't do what I did. I am so, so sorry. Really, really sorry. Really sorry. But there is no excuse for what I did. With my bloody hands, I took the thing I've been squishing and I put it in my mouth and I swallowed it lately. So he ate the eyeball. I would have I eaten the eyeball too if it meant not starving. Girls, boys, keep the restrooms clean. All right, let's go in the boys. See. If it feels weird being in the boys' room. Okay. Anything new? Is this guy gonna shout? Yep. Okay. Okay. I have I probably butchered that horribly. <laughs> Did you just hear that crazy voice? I didn't hear anything. I didn't hear anything, but we're definitely not alone in here. We should leave this room right now. Agreed. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Alright, girls room. <gasps> Seiko! What is this? I can't tell. What is it? <gasps> it's a shadow. <gasps> Naomi! Seems stained, but with what? Oh, almost looks like a person. Somebody Somebody died Somebody Somebody died here I can hear her voice I don't like this. Is she? Damn it all, what the hell is going on around here? Shinazaki! Is she like, um, have like a sixth sense or something? Are you alright, Shinazaki? もっと
何かあいつお前信じてたのにどうしてみんな私の意見を聞いてくれないのなんだよ何言ってかわかんねえよ Alright, she's in、uh, Psycho Land. I'm gonna talk to this thing. That poor girl. She's lost her mind and she'll never get it back. Possession is a frightful thing to have your thoughts push deep down into the pit of your soul and someone else's take their place. Well, I figured as much. Wait, I didn't read this before. Oh, I can't. Okay. Shinazaki! Shinazaki! Stop! Stop! Ayumi is staring at you as if transfixed with an unnatural wide smile stretched across her face. <laughs> uh, I don't know what to do in this situation. Ayumi! Ayumi is staring at you. <laughs> I don't know what, I don't know what to do. Except investigate. There's a dark stain on the floor in the shape of a person's body. It almost feels like there's someone here. It's really giving me the creeps. What the hell? The stall is pitch black inside. So we don't see. Anything else? This is. Shinozaki. Okashikunari soda. I feel like I'm losing my mind. Why is this happening to us? 